our thoughts by themselves are leading us to the purpose. If you will observe and gonna check your thoughts, just gonna look inside, you're gonna see that your thoughts are the thoughts that Hashem Barach is putting into your mind. Lacha amar libi bakshu panay tamid. Your heart is talking to you the logic of Hashem. Your heart from inside is always pulling you. Come closer to Hashem. Look for Hashem. Ask for Hashem. Try to find Hashem. If you're just going to listen to your inner voice, you will climb so high. You will achieve such high levels that we cannot imagine. And this is why Rabbeinu Rabbi Nachon of Breslev told us and guided us about it, Bodedut. And he said that every person must have one quiet hour, that in that hour he will talk to Hashem in Barach like you talk to your best friend. Everyone needs to have that outlet, have to have that opportunity, that, that window that he can scream through it, that he can talk, that he can share, that he can explain. And when you just let your thoughts flow out, go, you just speak them out, you just let them go, you just let your thoughts come out. If it's hard for you to talk, start with writing. Buy a nice notebook, a big package of papers, and sit and write your thoughts. Ask yourself, who am I? What am I doing? What I'm afraid of? What I supposed to do? What I'm dreaming about? What was I dreaming about when I was a kid, when I was a little girl? Who was I? What am I? Am I afraid? Am I happy? What do I want to change about myself? Learn. Express yourself. The spirit reveals itself and comes out when you speak. When you let your soul go outside and express itself. And we must do that. We must do that with all of our power. So at least one hour every day. There is no person without one hour. You cannot be a human being. You're not alive before you speak, before you reveal, before you have someone to talk to. And if you don't have a person, at least you have Hashem, the biggest gift of them all. When you get used to talk to Hashem, you find yourself being answered. You feel the presence of Hashem. As much as I'm going to speak to Him more, that's how much I'm going to remember Him more and more. Your faith will grow, will be increased. You'll find wonders. You're going to see huge, amazing, fantastic supervisions inside of your life. Because your own thoughts are leading you to Hashem. You have one thought that takes you to Hashem and all of the rest of the thoughts that you have are doubts and fears, but maybe it won't happen, but maybe I'm going to fail, but maybe I'm going to fail again, and who knows if really it's going to happen to me. Many other people tried that and they failed and they didn't achieve, but that person, he died in the end, and that person had to sell his house in the end, and that couple, they divorced in the end. So who am I? So why is Hashem going to answer to me? Those are the doubts. Those are the bad and foreign thoughts. Ignore them. Don't listen to them. Follow one advice. The advice of your heart. The wisdom that is taking you closer and closer to Hashem Barach. One thought, one lane, one path, one road, one way. Go look for Hashem. Just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator, to remember that it's all Him, never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those husks. husks.